My name is Esther Takeuchi, and my project and life goal is to make better batteries to make the world a better place. The research that we do really revolves around better batteries and energy storage in a broader sense. And whatever device they're powering, do a better job of powering the device than the batteries in use today. I was awarded the E.V. Murphy Award in Industrial and Engineering Chemistry for the work that I did on developing the battery for the implantable cardiac defibrillator. So the implantable cardiac defibrillator continually monitors the heartbeat and interrupts a specific form of heart attack. And if it senses that the heart has gone into an arrhythmia, it will deliver a large shock to the heart, interrupt the arrhythmia, and allow a normal heartbeat to resume. So a pacemaker sends a very small signal to the heart, just reminding the heart to beat. A defibrillator, on the other hand, is interrupting too many electrical signals in the heart that are spontaneously being generated. We needed to have a battery that could respond reliably and without delay. So when we were developing the battery uh, for the defibrillator, the most commonly used implantable battery was the pacemaker battery. But it was clear that because we needed a million times more power, we needed a different battery. We could not use the pacemaker battery. The battery is probably approximately two times the size of a cell phone battery, so quite thin. Uh, but what's remarkable when you compare it to a cell phone battery is that the defibrillator battery lasts five years, whereas a cell phone battery we're charging every day. So I won the National Medal of Technology and Innovation in the fall of uh, 2010. It was awarded by President Obama. And that was an extraordinary experience. It was actually my first time I'd ever been inside the White House. And um, President Obama talked about the importance of science, the importance of science research. He actually asked us to help his daughters with their science fair projects. And then on stage, he uh, knew what every one of us was getting the award for. And he commented to me, he said, so you're the one whose work has saved millions of lives. So it was really a very, um, very warm um, reception from the president.